This is Joe. I'm Mitch. I'm Travis. And we are Canada the movies. movies. This time we're gonna do Thor Love and Thunder. We are so sorry for cracking up as soon as we came on. But man, today's been funny already. Yes. Anyway, so Travis. Yes. What do you think about the movie? Well, the great thing we will say about Thor in the Dark World, it stars Chris Hemsworth, <coughs> Natalie Portman, Tessa Thompson, Taika Waititi, and Christian Bale. I can honestly say that this cast was amazing, but this movie... Mitch, tell them about this movie. <laughs> <laughs> well, Thor Love and Thunder. Oh, yeah, Love and Thunder. My <laughs> <head>. <laughs> I will say it was a movie. Mm -hmm. It was just visually, movie. visually remarkable. Great, we did 3D IMAX, so I felt like I was engulfed. It was the colors were beautiful. Mm -hmm. Christian Bale did his thing, his gore. Christian Pale. Christian Pale because <laughs> he definitely had was like the color. <laughs> <laughs> Natalie Portman did good. Everybody acted well. Mm -hmm. But to me, the story just didn't captivate me. I can honestly say my favorite part was Omnipotent City and Russell Crowe. Man, Russell Crowe. <laughs> that, that overweight <laughs> Zeus was hilarious. You ever wanted to see Gladiator after he won and became a rich asshole? <laughs> this, this is it. <laughs> there you go. He, he did his thing. That was, that was good. Yeah. Um... <laughs> What you thought, Joe? You bounced that off. Yeah. Like you said, it was all right. It was all right. It was all right. <laughs> it was one of the movies I will go see again because it's, oh, yeah. it's not like Morbius Eternals levels bad. No. no. But it wasn't great either. Like, I'm, I'm not really looking to, like, talk about this one as much as the other ones. Exactly. Because they did some stuff that just confused me and created yeah. some things that I don't exist in the comics. And I'm... I'm not one of those people that's like a toxic fan, but you got to prepare me for these things. Like, <laughs> I'm like, who is this person? Now, I, yeah, I understand when you got to take, yeah, you know, make some changes to the the comic story for the movie. That's fine. That's fine. Mm -hmm. But when you create whole beans and other things that just never came through, we don't know who this person is. And you want me to have some kind of attachment to it? Yeah, it just ain't gonna work. And I mean, was this a movie for the kids? Cause my boy Chris was bucket naked. Was kicking naked. Booty I ball. Mean, booty ball. Bucket, I was just bucket bucket expecting naked. that. Even in the trailer, I was just like, oh, they ain't gonna show it. They, they showed it. It was, it was a long like, scene. Too. Okay. I mean, a couple times I seen him cheats. Yeah. I. I mean, I, hey, it's do what different. you do. Yeah. Do what you do. But around wasn't PG thirteen. No, that ain't PG thirteen. Oh, PG thirteen unchanged. Unchanged. Well, yeah. somebody got some money to make it PG thirteen. Hey, it's gotta be that. You one. gotta pay the cost to be a boss. Pay the cost to be the boss. <laughs> I guess. But I'm not. I'm not really talking junk about the movie. I think it was no. a I movie, and it was like you said, beautiful visuals. Um, Parts of it was really cute to me. Like, you know, yeah. I was just like, oh, look at this happening right now. Yeah. I'm fighting at the same time. But. <laughs> the tones, more than anything, were off. It's like you're going to get a deep part of the movie where you're like, oh, we're seeing how people deal with cancer. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're seeing how people deal with the loss of a family member. And then you just get it out of nowhere. You got these ghosts just yelling, ah! <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't, How do you turn cancer with? into a joke? It's. They, they, tried. they did it. They, they tried. tried it. They tried. They tried. And they played Dr. Jane Foster's role as far as the story of the Mighty Thor. They did great with it. They yeah, did. That's they, they did. did. They, they succeeded in that. Mm -hmm. uh, I just, it was all right movie. That's, a, that's about the best I can give. All right. Without spoiling anything. Without it's spoiling anything. That's the best we can really say. Yeah. Now, I don't want y'all to think we're being super negative because honestly, when you hear these uh, scores that's about to come up, you'll be like, Oh, I would have thought this would have been worse, but no. I still recommend watching it. Just it's worth multiple viewings. You're gonna see people in the background, and you're like, "Wait a minute, that's kind of big. Why are we just not talking about it?" Yeah, yeah. Exactly. bro, there was so many things in the background nobody talked about. Mm -hmm. well, Easter eggs was there. There's a Black Panther scene in there. Yeah, you probably don't want to even see it, mm -hmm. but it's there. It's there. 
Like, anyway, so, 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 that probably could have been involved in the extra 30 minutes of this movie because it's under two hours. Yeah. So, <laughs> Honestly, that's real. If they had made it about 30 minutes longer, the movie would have been better. Yeah. I know there were some deleted scenes that would have made the movie make a lot more sense. It would have made to be. so much more. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and, we, and we're used to three-hour movies. So. Then they go again with yeah. these theatrical cuts. Release the the what, whatever the version. Is, the, the director's cut. The, the, Wachichi the, Wachichi the Wachichi cut. We need the Wachichi <laughs> cut ASAP. Anyway, <laughs> like next week, drop it off Thursday. Drop it off Thursday. I'll take it. I'll go. <laughs> I mean, I am going to get this uh, this this on Blu-ray. I mean, it's oh, yeah. in the dark world. Yeah. Well, I mean, what is it? I, I heard some people say this was their first, now their favorite Thor movie. No, it's it's still second favorite. Ragnarok yeah. still takes the cake. Ragnarok still. Three. Said number three. Yeah. Oh, you like the original better? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I, it's, it's not no, my number one. Yeah. But Ragnarok right still gonna be at the top. But mm-hmm. Thor one is better than that. You know what? I I I I respect that. Okay. I respect that. So it's definitely Ragnarok. Mm-hmm. And yeah. then this this one and the first one are probably neck and neck because it's some parts of the first one. I just every time I try to watch it, I fall asleep. Hey man, sorry. Did you watch Return of the I was there. Oh, I was there. I twitched. Then this will win by that one. Then it won by that one. Because <laughs> <laughs> I didn't fall asleep. Oh, but every time I fell asleep, like. <laughs> that's how I fell asleep. The ghost started yelling. So what? Yeah. Right there, I was like, yeah. <laughs> they did that for you. They, Look, don't do it again. <laughs> you ain't got to worry about me. I will watch it as many times as I can. Don't but worry. you know the ghosts are comic book actors. They are. Yeah. 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 That's awesome. Too too I love too I love that they jump in shark these days though, honestly. Like I can't disagree. <laughs> yeah. I love that they jump in shark. Anyway, so this doesn't go ten minutes. Uh <laughs> Mitch, what would you give this movie as a letter grade? Sir? As a letter grade, it mm-hmm. is a B minus. B minus, alright. That's what I'm stuck in. Trav? I'm gonna go a regular B. A regular, a regular B. B. Okay. I feel bad. Cause I got this as a solid C plus, but you know what? C's get degrees. Hey, very true. I mean, it's still passing. It's gonna graduate. Oh, <laughs> anyway, please click that like, share, and subscribe, as well as yes, ring please. that notification bell. Yes. We always got something going on over here at Canada in the movie. So always, always. <laughs> Trav Mitch. We're going to sign off. Peace. Appreciate you.